guys, what's up, you're doing fantastic and welcome to today's video. How are you guys doing? How is your mental health? How are you dealing with this quarantine shit? Is everything alright? You know, especially with what's going on in the world right now. Uh, this quarantine shit took longer than expected and uh, it affected many people mentally. Many people are falling into depression. So, yeah, I hope you're doing alright. I've uh, fallen into that too. That's why I was not uploading as much as I used to. I just was feeling quite empty, quite depressed, lonely. Uh, and I did a horrible mistake, ladies and gentlemen. I messaged my old friends, you know, just checked on them. Hey, what's going on? How are you doing? Miss talking to you. What's up, buddy? You know, just regular sh messages. And you may be wondering, well, what's wrong with that? That's wonderful. Not really, if you have the kind of friends I have. <laughs> I just sent a bunch of messages to my uh, old friends, just saying, hey, what's up, man? How are you doing? How is life? And uh, we used to get along very well. But guess what? No one replied. That hit me on another level, that made me even more depressed. I was like, whoa, god damn. Holy shit. <laughs> Am I a bad guy? What's going on on here? Am I missing something? Just because we did not talk for quite some time. Anyways. No one, no one replied, not even one. And, uh, yeah, that, I guess, does not come to a surprise, uh, considering the fact that it's my birthday, which was, like, two months ago, two or three months ago, uh, no one told me happy birthday, not even a single, sorry about that, not even a single soul. No one told me happy birthday except you guys. That's why I love this channel and uh, I enjoy uploading here. Yeah, so uh, this should not come as a surprise. But yeah, it uh, was not a pleasant feeling. So hopefully you're not going through the same. So I thought in this video I'm gonna be reading some stoic, stoic, stoic quotes. Stoicism, uh, and if you're not familiar with Stoicism, it's basically do not worry about stuff that is out of your control and just do you. So uh, let's let's read some quotes. Is this recording? Hold on. Yeah, it is. First quote, or quote, or whatever. Just keep in mind, the more we value things outside our control, the less control we have. Very wise. The tranquility that comes when you stop caring what they say, or think, or do, only what you do. Very wise again. Uh, the whole future lies in uncertainty. Live immediately. It does not matter what you bear, but how you bear it. A gem or gem, I don't know how it's pronounced, cannot be polished without friction. Not a man perfected without trials. To be calm is the highest achievement of the self. He has the most who is cont content. Content, sorry. He has the most who is content with the least. Very, very true. Self-control is strength. Right thought is mastery. Calmness is power. Man can cure conquers. I don't know what's wrong with my pronunciation. 
pronunciation to say today today man conquer conquers the world by conquering himself be stoic just do the right thing just keep going success is paid off based off your willingness to work your ass off no matter what obstacles are in your way when someone is properly grounded in life they should not have to look outside themselves for approval the ultimate power in life is to be completely self-reliant completely yourself to be stoic is not to be emotionless but to remain unaffected by your emotions learn to be indifferent to what makes no difference to bear trials with a calm mind robs misfortune of its strength and burden the willing are led by fate the reluctant drag too many people believe that everything must be pleasurable in life yeah a rational person can find peace by cultivating indifference to things outside of their control if you are easily provoked you are easily controlled be an island of calm in the sea of, of craziness relentlessly prune bullshit don't wait to do things that matter and savor the time you have i love this one be a master of the mind not mastered by the mind the more you seek the uncomfortable the more you will be comfortable failure and deprivation are the best educators and purifiers if it's endurable then endure it stop complaining between stimulus and response there is a space in that space is our power to choose our response the mind that is anxious about future events is miserable to make a goal of comfort comfort or happiness has never appealed to me a system of ethics built on this basis would be sufficient only for a herd of cattle if you make happiness your goal you will be disappointed if you make presence your goal you will be satisfied that's a deep one i love it that one that one wants nothing to be different not forward not backwards not in all eternity not merely bare what is necessary still less conceal it but love it just making sure this thing is still recording uh, the first rule is to keep an untroubled spirit the second is to look things in the face and know them for what they are nice the wise man is neither raised up by prosperity nor cast down by adversity for always he has striven to rely predominantly on himself and to derive all joy for himself the great law of nature is that it never stops there is no end don't explain your philosophy 
philosophy embody it I love to go and see all the things I'm happy without uh, the rubbed that smiles steals something from the thief and that is it guys I hope that made me made you think a little bit deeper and uh, made you feel a little bit